Welcome back to KSLA News. But for this Sunday, churches across the nation will encourage their congregations to do more to help children in crisis, particularly children in foster care. It's called Stand Sunday, and pastors will challenge their members to step up and get involved. So here to tell us more about it is Casey Kilpatrick Baird, founder and executive director of Go for Kids and community consultant Stacy Eppers. So ladies, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having us. Let's talk a little bit about Go for Kids in case anybody's not familiar with your organization. We got to fill them in on the great work you're doing. Well, thank you so much. So it's a grassroots organization that came out of this area. Um, we've served over almost 19,000 children with a go bag. Whenever kids are rescued, they have what they need for that first night. And because of the experience that I had personally in this area, and um, you know, we've expanded out from there. One of the things that Stacy is helping us with is a lot of the community relations and being able to pull in churches to be able to help the need that we have for foster parents. And that's how Stand Sunday came to be, right? Yes. yes. So it's a national initiative, and we are in crisis in the state of Louisiana. In our region alone, in the Shreveport region, we have over 500 children right now that are in care. And um, we need foster parents, we need adoptive parents, um, but also to be a successful foster parent, there's a lot of ways people that aren't geared towards that or aren't called to do that can help. And so Stand Sunday is about asking people to think about what's your contribution. So um, we're hoping that people will start the conversation, feel out where they are and move on from there. And help throughout the year. I mean, it might be mm -hmm. just that you know someone that's fostering or adopting and that bring them a meal, ask them how they're doing, mm -hmm. see if they do maybe watch their kids for a couple hours while they went to go shop or you go shop for them. There's mm -hmm. just lots of different ways that people can help. There's other organizations that also do that, you know, do different things with foster care or adoption or kids in crisis. And we love to be able to, you know, we just want the help to be there that mm -hmm. can help lift us all up. I think it's important that you, uh, what you focused on, that there are many different ways to help because mm -hmm. somebody may be saying, well, I'd like to be a foster parent, but I don't have the time or the qualifications. There are so many ways that you can right. give and become involved. I find for myself, pray, show up, and just be be aware of, of what it is. It might be somebody right down the pew from you. It might be one of your friends, neighbors, a kid at, so at your child's school. There's just some way that you can help and you'll know. I mean, if you're open to that, you'll feel that and know of that's your way to help. Um, you know, you can come pack a go bag. That's always an option. Mm -hmm. Please, you know, look at us on online. You can look at other um, entities that help in foster care arena or kids in crisis and help them as well. You, know, you could be a CASA, you could work at United Foster Care Ministry. You know, there's closets all over town that are part of different church groups like mm -hmm. Southwest Baptist. Mm -hmm. There's just lots of different ways that people can help and just find a niche, you know, just mm -hmm. stand. Stand That's for right. kids. That's it. Stand up, show up, and be there and help mm -hmm. support. Yes. Ladies, thank you so much for what you're doing and for, you know sharing the message about Stand Sunday. We've got lots of food for thought, and we really want to share it and encourage you guys to get involved. So for more information, you can visit the website on your screen, and you can find out how you can help.